information stealing malware. These used to be referred to as banking trojans, which is a term that, uh, that some people may be familiar with. Uh, but this is by far one of the most common forms of malware that we see uh, propagating on computers uh, in, a, uh, in a standard cyber attack. And there's a good reason for that. These are kind of the Swiss army knife of, uh, of attackers malware. They can do a bunch of things on your computer, like steal your passwords, hijack your bank accounts, steal payment card numbers. They can steal your data. And I know that bullet seems a little bit vague, but I promise you that's intentional. Uh, they can also remotely control your computer. And then the big one, they can install more malware. Or they can sell that access off to someone else. A great example of this is a piece of malware called Emotet. Uh, and Emotet for a uh, for a while between uh, 2017 and 2021 was considered to be the world's most dangerous malware. Not because it could break your computer systems, not because of necessarily what it could do, but because the uh, the threat actors behind Emotet had a relationship with other cyber criminal groups. And once they broke into your network and established their kind of foothold uh, in your uh, in your computer systems, they would turn around and they would sell that information and that access off to another cyber criminal group. Oftentimes that led to a widespread ransomware detonation after the fact. So now you've been hacked more than once uh, and you have ransomware in your system. So it's a, just a bad day all around for anyone who's in the information security industry. So malware for sale on the dark web is very, very common, uh, as, it, uh, as it turns out. We, uh, we found uh, quite a few forums that were just stocked with uh, illicit software that was for sale, and none of it's really that expensive. Here's a couple examples of that from the Vice City Marketplace, another one of those uh, aforementioned dark web, uh, dark web seller sites that we went to. Uh, you can get a ransomware pack with source code, instant delivery for $14.99. You can get a keylogger for $5. You can buy the Ultimate Ethical Hacker Tool Pack, which can be used to break into a lot of different kinds of organizations. That's about $50. You can even hire a hacker. For $80, you can hire a hacker to uh, perform an initial reconnaissance and break in on a system for you if you so choose. All right, so thank you so much, everyone. Again, my name is Matt Duran, security consultant with LMG Security. If you have any questions whatsoever, please feel free to ask them. You can email me at mduran at lmgsecurity.com. Uh, follow us on Twitter. Look me up on LinkedIn. Uh, and thank you again.